Today's video is made possible by A-Data, makers of the XPG V2 2800 MHz gaming memory. Good morning, everybody. Once again, welcome back to Tech of Tomorrow. It's launch day. That's right. The new GeForce GTX 760 from NVIDIA has hit the market, and we were lucky enough to get our hands on one really cool card from the people over at EVGA. This is with their ACX cooling, and this is their Super Clocked Edition. One thing that's really fun is the lady who was from UPS who delivered it she called me on the phone and she's all um sir will you be home because we have a delivery from Evga I was like Evga oh EVGA gotcha now I know what the heck she was talking about so with that said let's jump in let's check this thing out and see what this card's all about here on launch day all right, folks, so let's check it out. Right off the bat, we see two gigabytes GDDR5. It's by EVGA, obviously, not EVGA. We see we got the EVGA, they're the number one partner of NVIDIA. That's right. The thing has a three-way SLI capabilities. You don't get four, which you have three-way. Super clocked edition, and obviously the name of the card. I'm just going to flip it around, let you guys just see the back of the box. Just basically shows what the rear I.O. is, shows the ACX cooling. You guys can see right here, that's the model number and everything of the card, plus its serial number and all that good stuff. EVGA's warranty, their mod rigs, EVGA gaming, EVGA Sonet, all that good stuff. Precision X, that's their overclocking software. And that's pretty much it about the box. So let's just move on. Got a trusty little knife right here. I will make an incision up here into the plastic and then go ahead and just remove all that stuff off there for a Pretty much really much total true unboxing there right this thing's completely sealed up right here on the side we have a little thing i'm gonna go ahead and just open that right there pop the cap take the card out get all that good stuff out they have a lot of nice stuff in the box and we'll set the box off to the side so let's start off right here it looks like we have a giant poster those are always cool posters are always badass all right, once again, we have the game of Pwn. Arm yourself with the EVGA. Got a little bit hard to see with the camera angle right there because this thing's a giant size thing and uh, we're pretty close to the camera, but you guys see that. A nice giant size poster. That's really cool. A lot of people are gonna like that. Keep on going through here. Inside of here, they have a really cool case badge as well as the driver CD. So check this out. Here's the case badge. Powered by EVGA. I'm trying not to get my finger in there. Powered by EVGA. I'll move past that. The drivers. Everything's on this CD right here. Put it back in this little plastic package. Here we have a warning label. Let me get that up to you guys right here. It's saying to make sure that you plug the card in because if you don't, well, the card won't run or it'll overheat. One or the other. A little bit more about the nomenclature. It's a quick start guide there. Important notice, the EVGA G4 GTX 700 Series graphic card is a cutting edge card and ships with the latest technology, including a full UEFI BIOS. So you guys can see all that stuff there, just like a little bit more information. Then we have the stickers. That's right. So if you're a guy who likes stickers, enthusiast built by EVGA, bang past that. The graphics card user's guide. All the information about the cards inside of here, how to hook it up, how to install it on your board, all about the eight pin and six pin power connectors. Get past that. Here go all of our connectors right here. So first off, we'll go ahead and we've got the first the connectors right here. This is our DVI to VGA connector. Get that out of the way. Bang the next one out. The next one is two Molex to six pin. Two Molex six pin. Got one more right here. Go ahead and, and pull that out of the bag. And that is two six pin to eight pin power adapter. Got that one right there. And that's pretty much all the stuff right there. I'll just put it over here real quick so you guys can see and get the rest of that stuff out of the way. That's everything that's gonna come inside the box. Now let's actually move on and let's check out the card. So now we see the card is here. It's a nice little uh, plastic, obviously anti-static shell casing or they wouldn't put it in there. We will go ahead and take the card out. 
just get that out of the way for the moment. So let's start off right now on the front of the card. I'll go ahead and remove the plastic. And you guys can see right in the front, this is the EVGA GeForce GTX 760. Features their A6 cooling, two active fans. Underneath that, we can see all of the fins. And there's heat pipes underneath there as well, as I'm sure we'll see more as we move the card around. Just flip it around to the bottom side where you guys can see ACX Active Cooling Extreme. That's their cooling solution. I'm gonna go ahead and flip it around to the side of the card. Two slot design. PCIe 3.0 interface. Flip it around, show you guys into the, the card. You can see more of the aluminum heat fins. And actually right here on the side, you can actually see one of the copper heat pipes as well. I'm going to spin it around this way and we'll just spin the card this way at first. Here is your six pin and your eight pin power connector. Hence with those two little jockey things they gave us earlier. So if your power supply doesn't have to support this, you can have these two little plugs right here, this one and this one. And then you are up and going with your older power supply. So that's what those are for. Once again, we just see the name of the card. Flip it around real quick. Let you guys first see the back of the card. You guys can see these guys use a complete black PCB. Not that many people do that. And I know that's a big fan of a lot of people. They really like that. Up here on the top, go ahead and pull this tab. You see the two SLI fingers. And like they said earlier, this card can be used in three-way SLI configurations, no quad. So that's it, folks. We have actually a lot more stuff coming here today on launch day. Now, we'll have a full review, though, for you folks that are impatient. You guys want to see all the scores and all that stuff of the cards. We have the full written review, all the scores, and all that lovely information over on our website. If you guys go down there below the like button, you guys will see the description tab. Click on that where everything will be down there for you guys to go over and check out. Hope you guys like this video. If so, please make sure you hit that like button. Also, last but not least, a shout out to A Data once again for making this possible with their XPG v2 2800 megahertz gaming memory which you guys should really check out because this stuff just looks really really cool and we've got more coming including the full video review which will be coming later today see ya